no, 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 no. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Chase's W Gamer here. Welcome to Bendy and the Dark Arrival, aka Bendy and the Ink Machine 2. I literally cannot wait to dive into this. I just want to make sure. Uh, I say this for every game, but like, this it's been years. The trailer came out, I reacted to it. That was like 14 days ago. Like, how has it only been 14, 13 days ago? It, like, time's gone so quick. And it doesn't ask me to adjust my brightness. That's all set for me. So, yeah. Rumble strength. Oh, there's a lot of settings. It's interesting looking at all the default settings here, like effects, music, and dialogue is like just one bar down. I do want to say from the get-go, this main menu is so menacing compared to the first, I feel like. We've got new characters, the game visually it's a lot more darker. <laughs> the rain that's on the window must be the rain tapping on Audrey's house. Audrey, that's the name. Let's find out what's let's find out what's in store for Audrey's story. My voice just broke. Our protagonist for this game, which I know absolutely nothing about apart from what we've seen from the trailer. If she was mentioned in the first game or, or not, I would have no idea. Choose difficulty, easy. If you are new to the studio, uh, if you visited the studio before, which I have, if you have mastered the studio, then we're gonna go for normal. So um, yeah, I also saw something apparently that but this game is actually heavily inspired by Bioshock. No, it's just like the character models. If you look at Audrey like and, and stuff like that, the aesthetic, that's the word I'm looking for, is very similar. I can definitely see it. Okay, I actually thought this would be the intro cutscene. <laughs> Joey, Joey Drew Studios presents. It's weird seeing the real life. We're always. Free to choose. The real world here. We've never seen to believe what we want. These believe. graphics that isn't you know in Bendy before. It looks but insane. When you step back, when you really look at where you've been and the things you've done. God, it's about time. Your past will come. What is that? It's gonna be anticlimactic, you ready? To devour you. Wait. Are we going to be playing as Audrey? Like, in, I mean, in the real world first. June the 18th, 1973. Okay, so this is what we saw in the trailer. But I know she gets sucked into the cartoon world. And she looks horrifying, I must say, when we there play as go, her. Little guy. And only 800 more frames to go. Oh, that... No way I'm getting through tonight without some coffee. Probably some downstairs. Frame by frame. I don't know how anyone manages to do that. It's actually like frame by frame when it comes to animation. Press E to stand. Time for a little adventure. This is what I thought was going to happen, actually. Oh my god. Okay, no, the, sen the sensitivity isn't that bad. Can we see? Yes, yes, you can. I can always appreciate that in games. Right, I'm going to have to turn that up, actually. Ah, look at the elevator. Uh... Yeah, no, she gets horrifying when we see her in the cartoon world. I remember from the trailer. I feel like this is going to be a lot more scarier than to what uh, we're used to. I never actually did a series in the first game, guys. So we're in Audrey's office. It is five chapters like the first game, guys. And uh, it's all released at once, like with Tales of, from the Borderlands. <laughs> which I've only uploaded part one by the time I've uploaded this video. Let's put it up all the way. Yeah, why not? That's actually a lot better. All right, I've got my new keyboard as well. I'm so happy to be using it. Oh, oh! Uh, the animation oh i can uh, appreciate that so this is exactly what i was expecting to be honest when it came to uh the start of the game oh my god you can see your feet and you know <laughs> i really appreciate that your legs as well uh, and her breasts it's not just the feet it, it, you can see a lot more that's, that's what i'm trying to say <laughs> it's like outlast and your chest is what i should have said her house is horrifying like why 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 is it why is it like this I'm trying, really? to, I'm trying to remember if it's me in. collectibles. Good thing I brought my own key today. Wait, what do, you, what do you mean they locked you in? Retrieve your office keys. Who locked you in? I'm trying to sprint here, but it's not working. Why is she walking like that? All right. Um, Who put this here? Uh, oh, come on. Why would you react like that? Yeah, to be fair, I just remembered that always happened in the first game. There always used to be a bendy cow just appearing everywhere. Uh, oh, stop the thunder. It's so loud. Oh, so creepy looking at that cattle down the hall. What's... Okay, there we go. Here's the key. No, it's going to be a jump scare. Yep. Yeah. Oh, it's gone. Great. It's gone. I'm trying to think, actually. Did our protagonist speak in the first game? I think he he did, but it was rare. And uh, it, adds more it adds more character when the protagonist speaks, you know? Like that last two. Ooh! Not the most welcoming hallway I've ever seen. I thought this was your house, mate. Clearly not. But yeah, no, I'm trying to say like an Outlast 2. Hello? Is someone there? 
certain gunshot. Um, out of us too, Blake, you know, the protagonist you play as spoke compared to the first game, it was a massive improvement. I'm actually a bit frightened, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I like how there's an animation for every time you press the button. You know, you got black bars for the cutscene. We must be in this in, in the studio, right? This must be the studio. God, I've got the sensitivity all the way up. I thought, it, you know, it's actually not that much faster. We've also got pings I can see, so that, that's good. Press E to go down. <laughs> Who are you, Wilson? Wilson? To death. I'm sorry, my dear. Do you sound like that? Didn't mean to frighten you. You're working late tonight. A pretty girl like you shouldn't be wandering around all by yourself. <laughs> what was that in hell? Mind if I? No. Step in. No, sorry, I do care. Why are uh, you speaking like that? Uh, of course not. No. Thank you. Audrey, but you're you're so. Do you look like you could use a little company. I'm sorry, I don't know what approach they're going for with this character, but in my eyes, a hundred percent a predator. I was trying to find another word to describe him, so, but predator. It's been really nice this past week. Just beautiful, gorgeous. <laughs> no, he's. I'm sorry, he's a predator. It's, and of course, that? That, it doesn't affect him. It doesn't. Please tell me we're not trapped. Anymore. We're trapped. We're trapped. Don't you worry, my dear. Who are you? It's just a little short in this system. Happening a lot this past few days. I take it he works in the cartoons. Two. Oh come on, man! I, I thought this is all Let's just house. See what we can find. I don't want to go with you. Come along. No, 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 no. I'm used to going Old on my own. Wilson will protect you. Old Wilson will protect you. Brilliant. Wait, who's going first? Oh, Wilson. No. Imagine I just go into him and he just jump scares me. Yeah, yeah. Arch Gates Studios. Wait, I thought is it not Joey Juice Studios? All right, I'm gonna go without you, man. I'm just gonna get. Go oh, it's an invisible wall. Great. Press E to talk. Is he part of us? Just a few more switches to throw. Follow. If he's part of this, he's not making it will be perfectly safe. Follow Wilson, great. Yeah, he's not he's not doing a very good job at uh, being very uh sneaky about the fact he might be to do with this. The way he's speaking to me, it's just ugh. Does, he's so nah. Jerry Drew. Jerry Drew was the founder of the studio and the man who created Bendy, one of the most beloved cartoon characters of all time. Is that him? He looks like Disney. He looks like Walt Disney. What the, that wasn't that's intentional, surely. Just a pencil and a dream. City vision. I mean I'm really interested to read all of this, but it's just so much to uh yeah. I wonder if they're gonna um bring back the audio recordings. The tapes. Uh, can we just break, can we pick up that wrench and smack around the head? Why is he walking so slow? Hello. Looks like someone's been messing with the exhibits. There should be something on each of these pedestals. Audrey, sweet Audrey. <sighs> Do an old man a favor and go find it. My first puzzle, great. I'll tend to the power. Search for the exhibits. Oh yes, smack him around the head. He's gonna be behind us, right? Let me guess. Yep, yeah, he is. He's gonna jump scare us. I know he is. Come on. No. Okay. No, he's there. All right. Search for the exhibits. No, oh, he reminds me of uh, Goofy, but I'm gonna take it as his inspiration. But what's his name? Gosh, I can't remember his name from the first one. From the first game. Wait. Ah, hello. I love how there's an animation for everything. It's great. And like when you have to interact with Wilson to speak to him so that a cutscene can start. So you're not just standing there awkwardly looking looking around. It's just cool seeing colour. Alice Angel. Bendy the demon. Yeah, those cutouts can actually like be so scary when they're just placed there on the way you have to go sometimes. They seem to be everywhere. I remember that from the first game. Can we check our inventory or wait, uh, press either place? Alright, cool. So we got that. Does it matter where we put them? No, no, it does. It does. It does. Sorry, I can see the uh, the icon there. So we need one more thing. What is it? Sorry, is that a book? We need a. Oh, we need all these. Okay, so a book, an ink pot, uh, a music note, and a plushie of Bendy. Oh, hello. Yeah, I need that. Perfect. 
There's no way it's an animation for everything. That's incredible. Okay. A music note. Does that have to do... Yes. Yes. Okay. And then the last thing we're going to look for... That's the thing with like every horror game. It's all to do with puzzles. It's the primary side objective, apart from running away most of the time in horror games. But yeah. All right, cool. Hello, Walt. I keep thinking every time I have to turn around after the cutscenes. It's going to be a jump scare. What are you looking at, Wilson? Been there for a long time. Ink pot. The records. My favourite. The bendy plushie. Is it this book? Or is it is it a precise book? We're at a bookshelf here. So, oh, hello. It's got to be this one, right? The Illusion of Living. Jerry Drew. The only book with a front cover. Here we go. The Illusion of Living. Ah. Perfect. We, do, we finish at the exact same time. How coincidental. Only one thing left to do. And that would be... That switch. Uh, okay. Turn on the power. Let's do it. Great. Now we're in the... It is done. Oh. No. Oh, so obvious. Great. So the obvious. Set in What's happening? Here we go. So is this a sequel? Don't fret. We're going home. Stay back. Listen to me, Audrey. Pay attention to these last words. Does he always speak like this in the studio? Because very soon you will forget everything. Let He's gonna throw me go. in the ink. That's horrifying. We, we die. What? Well, yeah, I need you to explain a little. I, we're gonna have to find him so we can explain all of this. <laughs> Unless we'll find out on our on our journey. Title. That's that was that's pretty good. Well, I'm glad we got to play around in the color. Right, now we're in the ink world. Disneyland. I hear dripping ink. This is, this is really well made. It's really disturbing. <laughs> Wilson knows your purpose. Oh, What's happened to you? Uh, imagine being covered in ink. Oh, of course, it's the first objective. Escape the studio. Yeah, because it's going to be that easy. Who is that? Hello? All right, we're in it. Yeah, the ink must be fine, all right? Every great story begins in mystery. Although things may be dark at the start, a truth will illuminate your way. Don't be afraid of who you are, fear only what you may become, and banish it away. Your best pal is my best pal. Memos are stored in the pause menu. Okay, so it's like um documents, like an outlast. How do I interact with that? It's yellow, but I don't know uh, how to interact with it. Who is that? What's going on here? I feel like it's not going to be pings from now on, so yeah, to find out what you got to do, you got to go right up to the, the stuff. Oh my god, look at us. Let's see what we look like. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. Let's, let's, let's no. I remember from the trailer. I'm pretty sure we'll see her again in the cinematic. Uh, I don't know how to climb a ladder. Oh, are you not going to say anything? Oh. There we go. <laughs> it was missing. It, the ladder was missing. Okay. It looked like it was... It, it already had uh, certain steps for me. If I show you... I've, oh, oh! It need, yeah, it requires them. It, from my perspective, it, it looked like they were already there. Like, it was just different to the other um, ladder steps. <laughs> okay. That's one. And there's two. Why, why, was, that in, why was that in the drawer? <laughs> Alright, there we go. 
Oh my god, you're not gonna say say anything to this girl. <laughs> Jeez, you think I was drowning kittens? The way these people are looking at me, I've never seen such disappointment in a, in a person's eyes. But this is a it's, this is the way of things. If management can't pay their bills, then the banks takes the goodies back. Still, it does break me a, a bit knowing how much I love them old cartoons this place used to make. Oh well, times change and life moves on. Teddy Wester. Okay, so that's another memo. Oh wait, no, that's a ping. Look on the right, guys. There is, a, I think that's a ping anyway. Keeps them moving. So what's the point of this? <laughs> Creepy. <laughs> Could you always see your body like this? Like Definitely a new villain. Oh, we've got to hide. Is Wilson. Uh, sorry, Wilson. Hang on just a moment. Jerry, Jack and I have been wondering if you can meet us, uh, meet with us considering the current situation. We have been with you for so many years and we feel we have con contributed to the success of Bendy in the past. Our interest is purely in keeping this company strong. We just want to help however we can. Let's talk. Sammy Lawrence, I remember him. Your friend, your I'm trying to remember what happened to the protagonist in the first game. Whoever that was. Oh, this is interesting. The ink drips. Darkness has spread through the studio. Uh, the reaching shadows creep around you. Something hungers for your corrupt flesh. It's close. So very close. It strains to grab you. Choke you from behind. You will feel its breath upon your neck. It is close. Definitely the ink demon. Oh, gosh. Why do we spawn in different locations? Or does it just, like, spawn you, like, where you laugh, left off, and you go in it? Because he can leave whenever he wants to fall. Like, he just grabbed us. He put us in it. Whoa. Hi there. Who are you? What happened to you? More like the ink demon get you? Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, this is what I was on about earlier. Audio logs. Security override. Oh, here we go. We can run now. Let's go. No, we're running into the frown, mate. Oh, we've got a stamina bar. Hello, Bendy. One of the interesting characters we're going to meet him within. What was that? What was that sound? I'm lost. Am I dead? Have I just messed up? I think I died. I think that's a respawn animation. Oh, yeah, my PC might not load that in in time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it kills you like it's like some sort of invisible wall. Poppy Playtime did that. It would just be a black like area and I go into it and I'll, I'll just die because my PC did not, does not load it in in time. Is that my health? Okay, so I just went back the wrong way. I don't know how we heal just yet, but I'm sure we'll find out when we're meant to get damage. Oh, all the way back here. Yeah, it's loaded in now. It was my PC. If something doesn't look right, I'll make sure to wait for the pop in. I thought that wouldn't do anything because... The ping's here. No, no, no. Run. Run and hide. How'd that not kill us? We died. We died. Where is he? Go in here instead. I didn't make it in time. Can you see when we go in there? No, 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 no. Yeah, you just see us going in, so what was the point of that? That was... Who are you? Hello? Food. Oh, low on health? Grab a snack. Survival will mean some dangerous situations. When you're low on health, you'll need to eat. Locate hidden food stashes all throughout the studio. Okay. So is this some food here? You're meant to get damaged, right? Yeah. Classic tutorial on games, making you, you know, <laughs> get damaged. Whoa, hello. Who are you? But the aftertaste, it's not so good. Easy now, I'm not gonna hurt you. Do you not see that creepy guy? Look like you needed some help. 
Don't touch me. What are you? Ugh, what is this horrible place? Yeah, I remember my first day down here. I know, it's scary. Uh huh. But you're actually pretty lucky. The machine could have turned you into a searcher. You mean that, that thing that attacked me? No, that's a piper. And he's part of a gang, so be careful. I don't understand any of this. I can't think. It hurts. You'll catch on pretty quickly, if you can stay alive. Lesson one. Searchers don't have legs, and they tend to swarm. Look, it's not good to stay in one place for too long around here. Keep moving, and stay close to the shadows. All right, time up, Freddy. Take my advice. Head to the upper levels. It's safer there. Can I come with you? You can't. I'm sorry. I have a wolf. He doesn't care for strangers. A wolf? Like I said, you'll catch on. Why are you here? Good luck. I hope we meet again. Who are you? Oh, and one more thing. Above everything else, stay away from the ink demon. What's an ink demon? Well, you'll know him when you see him. He likes to smile, and he kills anything that moves. Wait! What's your name? They call me Alice. Oh, you're Alice! You're in the game I'm now! I'm very fond of it. I'm Audrey. Well, Audrey. I'm now a cartoon character. Welcome to the studio. You're naturally a character. You're a Wait, what? Uh, escape the studio. Chapter one, drawn to darkness. That's how you introduce me to the chapter? Actually, I am gonna put my, oh God, I actually look horrifying but i fit in so well i got yellow eyes i'm gonna put the graphics on medium there we go Come on, i think the motion blur makes it more massive there you go that still looks fine around here it's just best to stay outside don't ever go running into some place if you don't know what's in there that's actually what i did earlier if you attack a, a problem head on you're going to find yourself in trouble and that's just foolish you gotta watch you listen and when the time is right push forward your best pal <laughs> you never know when your pc isn't gonna handle it <laughs> okay so that's a hiding spot yeah I'm, I'm pretty much like black ink so it's all good all right, where are we actually going here? Does this open this door? Or is that already open? Oh, look at me. Oh. I'm... Hear me out. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm not really. She's actually... She's still hot. Where is the toyman? Yeah, so those gen corporation boys are kind of... So that is actually for the story as well. I thought it was just for lore. Those tapes. <laughs> you need to listen to it for the for story progression. Okay, sweet. Not all of them, but yeah. Uh, okay, let's listen to this. He sees everything. Ink Demon or Wilson? It seems that all yeah, Wilson. Studios in all its oh gosh. Misplaced admiration was so eager to absorb the life's work of that crooked show. We need subtitles for this stuff. I could tell 
that this cruel device held secrets. Secrets that could be mine. So creepy. Why is it, did he have to speak like this? Bendy and the ink machine. Oh. Right, okay, we've got the next indicator. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, hello. Why? That can't be healthy. So that's an upgrade? Permanently upgrade your maximum health. Why would you just punch that? Permanently upgrade your maximum stamina. That's something else we haven't unlocked yet. Search for more hidden unstable ink to unlock more upgrades. I'm gonna go for stamina. Consume the thick ink canister. Oh, hello. Factory floor? Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. It looked inconvenient. Boris, that's his name. Well, that one. Yeah. Looking at a plushie there. Locked, uh, unlock the maintenance gate. We're gonna need some sort of weapon. Uh, turn around. Oh, don't do that. Wait, Wilson knows? What just happened? Wilson knows what? Collected slugs. Stuff is really hidden. What can we use with that? Gent parts. What of this stuff was it in the first game? Are we gonna ever find out who the hell, who the heck that girl was that was crying? What's up here? Oh. Just a tune. Usually it's when you walk away, you can't hear anymore, but you can go anywhere in this game. Bro, that audio log sounds like Homer Simpson, I'm not gonna lie. Right, I just searched this desk and collected gent's battery. Oh, hello. Nothing. Not me thinking that it said hide instead of search. Oh. So there's gotta be a key in here, right? Yeah, there we go. There must be, is there any other lock? Wait. Search, yeah. Oh, hello, what's this? Because I, I, I just, oh, I should have read it. <laughs> I'm so used to like hiding in lockers, you know? Because I know you can hide in lockers in this. Because I went all the way back. <laughs> and I actually went past a vending machine where you can buy food, I found out. No jump scare, intriguing. Animation alley. Caution keep closed. Oh, no, 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 this game's actually scary. I, I didn't I didn't expect that at all, to be honest. Save your game anytime in the pause menu. No, I've got auto save, it's all good. <laughs> Studio tour. My heart is racing. Oh, you got to be close to this one. Right, okay, thanks for that, mate. I appreciate the uh, the intel. Where did that guy come from? I swear we saw him before earlier. Beautiful ink showers, gotta love them. Hello, what's through here? Oh, yeah, see, hides, do you know what I mean? Like, do they look different to the searching ones? That's something I need to find out. Oh, that's locked. Little devil lounge. Hide, buy, yeah, I can buy, buy. Now I'm good for health. Oh, hello. Why is there a heartbeat thing going on? I can't even go through there, that's locked. I hear a heartbeat, but I don't know what that... Well, that is. It's when I went near there. Okay, that's the way I went, sorry. Right, okay, in that case, let's go through the door we were uh, about to be opened. Main studio, that says. Locked. I'm gonna find another... Oh, okay, this is the same key you can use. Locked again? This uh, is getting old. Are you serious? Break the lock. Okay, I guess that's where we're gonna find our first weapon. Audrey, how did it, it's Alice. How did it break? Can you hear me? Yes, Alice. Give me a second. 
Oh God. Okay, management has come up with a new way to reward us employees. Instead of paying out bonuses or overtime, they've started handing out these little tokens that you can spend in company vending machines. Besides that, these tokens ain't got value of any kind. Obviously, a lot of people don't like the idea, but the best part about the whole thing is that within a week, someone figured out how to make fake tokens that fools the vending machines. We started calling this fake one slugs. Okay, I've been picking it up. Now, I can't remember the last time I've seen a real token around here. Them slugs are everywhere. Probably cost in the studio a ton of money in stack alone hudson doyle doyle Do Do yeah we're gonna say that i'm coming i'm ca alice please answer me yes i'm here <laughs> how do you know i'm here let's take that talk it it's alice can you hear me there's so much you can get by the way look look there's only one item i haven't oh two items like is that keys look how many items you can collect right okay hello audrey oh, i'm so glad you're all right uh, alice I think you and I have very different definitions of all right. Where are you? Animation department entrance? But it's locked up tight. Good. That means you're heading up. Look for anything you can use to break in. Maybe there's a gent pipe nearby. What was that? No. There's something in here. Audrey, find that gent pipe. Now. Oh no, is it a timer thing? Find the gem pipe. Anything doing that much destruction? Is that red? Red blood? Anything doing that much destruction has got to be the ink demon, right? What is that? No, what are you? Oh, there's got to be a weapon somewhere. Over here? I'm meant to have a weapon by this point, aren't I? Wait, where's... Oh, it's in there. There's the gem pipe. Great. Where did that thing go? Way too dark in there. Well, we need a light or something. We need to get the lights working first. Oh, okay. I was thinking of a flashlight, but you know. <laughs> what to that thing? This is gone. Restore power to... What? Okay, why is it locked? Though? Search. Uh, nothing in there. Anything I try to search, there's nothing ever in there. Who's in there? Open up. Last one. If I find you, I'm gonna rip your face off. What the heck? Uh, stealth. The best way to avoid trouble is not to be seen. Remain crouched, just stay low, and keep your footsteps from being heard. Watch your enemies carefully so you may pass through safely. If something detects you, find a place to hide or get away fast. Okay, so classic horror game rules. You know, security breach, outlast, etc. Ooh! Okay, he's going that way. That's good. We're just gonna go through the way you, uh... What's he doing? Well, at least he speaks. Okay, let's go through here. Let's try to find out from... Let's see if I can find one. Don't speak to yourself. Find the fuse. So this is where I find out proximity chats in the game. We can hear my microphone. Rip let's players. Great, we have to go back. So that's not gonna go well, is it? Right, so what was the point of that? Speak Alice, I need a distraction. Oh, that movement. Listen to the sound of it. <laughs> Oh my goodness. He's got yellow eyes as well. So you a searcher, I take it? I'm a searcher as well, I've got yellow eyes. Why did you break that? What is the point? You could have just walked around, man. Probably should have done that, but it's all Gucci. What's that? Peak. Oh, that is a cool mechanic. I like that a lot. Realistically, they would see if you did that, but it's all good. <laughs> but it's all good. Kitchen's it closed. So it's two now. His name's Lost, they're called Lost One. You cannot see me, you serious? I'm one of you guys, right? Oh, no, 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 go go in the locker. We could just hide behind, um, I think maybe one of the barrel tables. I'm not too much of a fan of the animation. I'm, yeah, I mean, uh, everything else. It's pretty sick. Even the atmospheric music right now. Wait, would he hear us if... Okay, no. That's a bit str... Uh, yeah, we're screwed. I wonder if he can see us through there. What are you eating? Can you see us? No, you can't. I'm gonna run. <laughs> Cannot interact during combat. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. Oh, okay, it's a cutscene. Well, now what? I need to hide. Why do I do that? I need to stop rushing. <laughs> Why do I run? Can, so, do they lose you if, I, for example. What? You did that in the first game as well, I think. Strange. Okay. I don't know why that is. Okay, it's trying to get in the vendor machine. <laughs> oh. Oh, he does hear that. Oh, no, I don't like that. 
No, I didn't mean to do it. Are you serious? I bought such slugs instead of grape. Can you crouch? No, you can't. Oh, we should be able to use them as distractions. Yeah, I shouldn't have sprinted this. I thought we killed him at the end of the first game. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah, okay, cool. Okay. Yeah, we've got... Well, happy birthday to me. <laughs> Fix the fuse box. Full charge gem pipe required. Yeah, do not sprint and make that mistake again. Oh, what? Oh, we can't go over there. But I found a little secret there. Yeah, I'm going to run past you because... Um, there's a locker over here, right? Cool. There we go. There you go. He's just ran away. <laughs> so now if we get... Oh, gosh. Uh-oh. Strange. Ah. So it's like a peeking thing. I guess We're he just... not alone down here. Can't see you when you do that. So that's pretty cool. Okay, let's head back. Oh, no, we could have just went through here, couldn't we? Because, yeah, they... Okay. Atrium supply. Lights are on. Time to get that gent pipe. Oh, he's not here. Oh, he is. Oh, he missed. <laughs> That's actually really scary, the sound it makes. Oh, he did find me. I tried to tell them he was up to something. I tried to tell him. Interesting. You sound like an... Uh, Don't cry for me. I want to die. What? Yeah, he sounds... Yeah, why is he doing this? He sounds like an inmate from Outlast. So it seems if you die, it just carries straight on. The stuff I accidentally bought from the vending machine, I probably still have. Anyone here? No. Locked. I'll tell you what, the doors actually remind me of that game. Um, I found... Oh, was it? Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Okay, we're playing with fire. No question about it. First, Gent comes in here and puts thick, heavy pipes over everyone's head. Must weigh a ton. Then Joey opens up a place for tours to the general public. Are we really thinking this through? For Pete's sake, Sammy's music department is constantly flooded. And while I was giving a tour last week, we almost lost the whole dang wall of vent when a valve blew out. Stupid tour group applauded, thinking it was part of the show. I know Joey is looking to drum up some cash lately. But this, this is just asking for disaster to strike. One good accident and there's going to be a landslide of trouble. Hudson Doyle. The dark puddles are calling. Well, that's a lot of loot. Yes, please. All right, cool. Uh, what are we looking for here? Whoa, demon follower. Oh, thank God. We can use this as a weapon. I know it. We had one of these in the first game. At least now I can defend myself. Yes, gem pipe, a weapon of many uses. You're all in one tool for surviving many dangers. The gem pipe has many useful functions and upgrades once you find the right parts and schematics. To use, press, this shouldn't be a double space there, should there? Press to attack enemies and break objects. So that'll be left click. Okay, break the lock using the gem pipe. So I take it this is the other upgrade option the game was on about, right? Unlock powerful gem pipe upgrades by finding gent schematics throughout the studio. Unlocked upgrades, okay. I'm gonna break you no! God, this game is actually scary. This is scary. This is actually terrifying. Loot! And it just they just explode. Okay. Oh, I love how we got a weapon now. Thank you. It's like a secure reach when you first get a phaser blaster or a fast cam. You're like, ah, there we go. Much better. Oh, my health. At least I can see my health bar. No, no, no. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. So I need food or something. I can't fight all of these guys. The machine must endure. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Ooh. I got you. You highlight. You highlight. You highlight. Right. Loot. Loot. Oh, so they did all have something because I looted the first person there. Did nothing. Sweet. Uh. I love how cinematic this game is, man. God, one of us now. That reminds me of um, Shadows of Rose. Instead of ink, it was mold on the floor, but it's still the same color. 
with a tad bit of red in it. Unless we're talking about the main game of Resident Evil 8. Like, literally, it, was, it looks the exact same. Mold in the ink. Who are you? Ink Wilson? Well, they give up quick, don't they? You don't have to kill me. Do I not? That is a choice game. What was that? Banish. Oh, this must be the other upgrade. The powers of the ink are yours to command. What? Looks like a Halloween skin for FNAF AR or something. Use your powers to send monsters back to the dark puddles. While crouched and undetected, in the literally shadows of Rose, interact with an enemy from behind to banish them. Banishing also restores a portion of your health. Okay, let's do it. Crouch or use banish to unaware enemies. How did she know she could do that? I was the attacker and uh, that jump scared me for some reason. That actually, the sounds are, ugh. Uh, can't interact with that, out of order. Okay, so we need to get past the, oh. That's one leap of faith I definitely won't make. Yeah, we're gonna get past the cap. Find a way across the abyss. Well, this is here for a reason. God, look at my hand, that's actually so sick. Right, okay, maybe I'm pushing that the wrong way. Deposit? What's that for? Exchange? Uh, uh, create gent card grants one-time access to safe and sound lockers. I need one, one more of those things. Oh, there's a little secret door there. Yeah, let's push that out of the way. We should be able to get through. What is that? What is that? Okay, sweet. Oh, no. Okay, let's do it. No, I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die, I'm about to die. I press hide! I press Oh goodness. I press hide! Oh This is so difficult. Why? I should have upgraded my health. Oh, that was close. Oh that is cheeky, man. They can't see me. I'm gonna go up to an enemy and do my use my power. Cause I need health. Vanish. Goodbye. And then I'll finish this guy off because he's weak. There we go. Sweet. Oh, it's loot. Nothing from you. Can't loot banished enemies. Where's that coming from? Oh, that was the hiding one. Oh, it's hard to tell the difference. Here's where the magic is made. I'm Joey Drew, and our story Yeah, I thought I recognized your voice. Literally in one of our many writers rooms. Charlie the Butcher guy. Like this one. That's right. All your favorite bendy cartoons are born right here. We circle up our chairs, crack open a cold drink, and toss around dozens of story possibilities. There's no bad ideas here. We've all got something we can bring to the scripts. I myself have been known to spend a lot of time down here with the fellas, tossing in my own brand of Joey Drew magic. It's my job to push the envelope with my big creative touches, <laughs> and I love it. Yes, sir. You'll always hear endless laughter coming from the writer's room. Fascinating. The script finds its way to our many artists in the art department. You'll be seeing our real Joey Drew Studios team hard at work on our tour of Animation Alley very shortly. But right here, you can see a typical office where characters are being lovingly crafted with very careful attention to details. I like to stand over their shoulders as the artists work their magic. It's my job to catch the little things that make our cartoons really extra special. Yeah, I can see if it. I, see I can see one of Bendy's gloves is missing his signature two dots. I make sure I tell someone. That Joey Drew, they like to say, what a keen eye. Over time, the cartoon is slowly created frame by frame. Bendy begins to walk and dance. It's really quite fantastic. Before long, we have our finished cartoon. All ready for the boys in the sound department to take over. 
What was in there? I was just too busy looking at this the whole time. Uh, yeah, no, I was gonna say, I can, see, I can see how this is compared to Poppy a lot. Wait. Oh, not listen to all that again. Battery refill? Oh, I'll just get one. Okay, that's cool. For free as well. What's this one? Oh, I see. Oh, now they're both speaking. Make it stop. Oh. No, oh, that's a cool detail. I'm getting out of it. I'm getting out of it. I'm not listening to them. I'm not listening to them. Oh, hello, loot. Got a full table of loot there. Uh, we're in the final days here, I can tell. People are panicking things into boxes. Tools are, g are going missing. You can smell the panic in the air around the studio. But us gent boys, we're just watching from the shadows. We lock the doors and keep our research g going. Mr. Grey already gave us a little wink. Uh, all, all is well. When one ship sinks, another one leaves the dock. I just need to keep the my ink machine safe in the chaos. It's the key to so many discoveries. Thomas Connor. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of this room. Still talking. Bendy? I remember seeing him in the, in the trailer, but is this the actual Bendy? Uh, he's acting like a child. Bendy? You're real? Speak. Oh, amazing. It's okay. I won't hurt you. See a kid in the cartoons? It's okay. Must be weird seeing your an See? your animation, your I'm cartoon, your, your cartoon in 3D. Right? Oh. That was actually. I'm sorry. I didn't know that would happen. Oh, that's like... He was adorable. I'm so, so sorry. The way. Oh no. The way he was holding my hand. Damn it, Audrey. You used the wrong hand. You should have held him with the... Yeah. Aww. He was crying as well. You see that? That's actually so sick. Don't knock. No visitors go away. Right. Okay. Well, in that case, guys, I think I'm going to end this part here because, you know, we found Bendy. He's ran away. But oh, we still got to get across the abyss. But still, we found Bendy and I think that's pretty cool. Thank you all for watching. If you didn't do it, if you didn't do it, if you did enjoy it, don't forget to smack a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new around here. Notifications on. You also get a notification for uh, when I next post my next part on Bendy and the Ink Machine. So far, stunning visually. Story, interesting. And I always do find the mystery quite interesting as well. I believe this is a, this is a sequel because I'm trying to remember what happened at the end of the first game. The Ink Demon, or well, we was meant to die. And uh, yeah, obviously we didn't shut down this cartoon world if that's even a possible thing. Alice is on our side. Bendy's a real thing, and I love that. Alice is a cartoon. We, we get to see her as a character. Bendy, like I just said, I think that's so sick. But um, yeah, I need to find one, another one of these things so I can upgrade my health, because I, I don't think you can do it here. Yeah, you got to wait until you... I mean, okay, that's fair enough. All right, then, guys, take care, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.